Hello, it's Elliot from Kent Estate Agencies, and today I'll be showing you around Heavenly Cottage. Now, Heavenly Cottage is located on Seaview Road, which is one of Herne Bay's most popular locations and is located only a few moments away from the seafront. Now, the property dates back to around 1725, and over recent years, the property has undergone a beautiful and extensive sympathetic refurbishment. So you've got absolutely nothing to worry about here it's all done for you and it's been done with a real elegance and flair it's absolutely stunning and we'll go through and take a look So as we step through the front door, we're instantly greeted by this beautiful little reception space. Now, this reception space gives you some really, really good practical storage. Now, as we come through, we find ourselves in the front sitting room, which, as you can see, is presented beautifully. You've got all of the little finishing touches with this property, and you'll see that completely throughout. We'll walk through now to the second reception space, which has the dining area located just off of it there. And again, you can see here, you've got that beautiful log burner there, which gives you a really nice, cozy and enclosed feel in this property. And that's the interesting thing. It is a very large property. There's a real abundance of space here, but it gives that really nice, cozy feel to it. You've got the window seat there, looking out onto your beautiful front garden, and it's set back really far from the main road so you can't really hear anything at all and it gives you plenty of space for parking as well but again as we look at this second reception space you can get that really nice sense of how cozy it is and just how beautifully it's been finished We're now in the main dining space that comes with this property and you'll notice those beautiful vaulted ceilings in here making for a really, really unique uh, space to enjoy with friends and family. It's absolutely beautiful and to have those French doors leading out onto the back garden is again just absolutely wonderful. The kitchen here at Heavenly Cottage really is beautiful. You've got a wonderful mix of Korean worktops here, again with those really lovely cupboards there as well. And you can see that you've got a real plethora of uh, integrated appliances. You can see that you've got the American fridge freezer, there's an abundance of power points. You can see there that you've also got a really, really nice breakfast area. Now you've also got the wine cooler here as well which is really, really wonderful. And as you come along to the end, it's this really nice little enclosed breakfast area, which makes full use of the back garden there as well, which is really nice and quiet and enclosed. And we'll go and take a look at that a little bit later. Now, it's also worth mentioning that just off of this kitchen space, you do have the utility room 
as well. And the utility room, of course, has plumbing for your washing machine. There's plenty of space in there for a tumble dryer as well. And it's got some really, really nice quarry tiled flooring in there as well. As we've made our way upstairs, we'll give you the opportunity to have a look at the bedrooms that come with this property. And we'll start that by going into the master bedroom. Now you'll see you've got, again, those wonderful characterful features, including that fireplace and a really beautiful little window that opens out onto the front garden. You'll see here that you've got plenty of space for a double bed, plenty of space for storage, wardrobes, chest of drawers, plenty of space for it in here. It's a beautiful, beautiful bedroom and enjoys again those lovely views over your enclosed front garden there. We're now in bedroom number two. Again, you've still got those wonderful character features, including the fireplace and the lovely window there leading out onto the front garden. And you can see the radiators here as well are those really nice big cast iron character for radiators. Again, in this room, you've got plenty of storage. Uh, you've got, of course, the built-in wardrobe cupboard there. You've got the chest of drawers and you've got the wardrobe as well as plenty of space for the double bed. And you'll see those lovely wood beamed flooring there as well, which is just beautiful. We'll take you through into the bathroom that's located just again on this first floor of the property and you'll see it's got a real emphasis based on luxury. You've got that wonderful claw foot roll top bath and a beautiful, beautiful finish in this room that just again oozes luxury and is going to give you an amazing space that you can really, really relax in.
So after looking at that main bathroom, I'll take you along now and show you this beautiful, really, really nice shower room that you've got at the end, which adds a real sense of practicality to the first level of this property. Of course, you've got those two bedrooms at the front. You've got that really lovely, big, luxurious bathroom and a really nice big shower room at the end there as well. Now, it's also worth noting here that you do have bedroom number three, which is located on the second floor, just up the set of stairs here. And again, that's a fantastic size that measures out at about 12, 11 by 11, six. So that is a really, really fantastic size room. And you've got built in double wardrobe cupboards up there. You've got the radiators up there and the power points as well. Now we find ourselves in the rear garden here which i mean it is absolutely beautiful it's enclosed it's private and you've got a really wonderful mix of seating areas and grassed area here as well It's certainly worth saying that when you're in the rear garden here, there's been a real emphasis made on enjoying this space with friends and family. It's absolutely beautiful. You've got that really nice brick paved patio area and a very nice uh, raised decked entertaining space as well. Now it's worth noting you do have the summer house and there is all external lighting here as well. Now, bearing in mind, you've got plenty of side access here, so you can easily make your way from the front garden and to the back garden and vice versa. It's again, a really, really wonderful space that you're going to be able to enjoy all year round, especially in those summer months when you've got friends and family over though.